It has been a violent week right here in Louisville. More than two dozen people shot, but tonight one teenager is sharing how he was able to overcome a tragedy in his own family. The night team's Heather Fontaine has his story. And get to live out his dreams. I live in form. It was one of the proudest moments of Darrell Howard's teenage life with his father by his side. He was the first one to, to jump over. Uh, at Kroger Field, jump over the stand. The Central High School linebacker had just won the state championship. Next stop, college ball. I had my paperwork, I had everything figured out, I had my payment plan. But by summer, a year with so much potential turned into one of tragedy. I had uh, news that my father was like murdered. Um, it was, it was uh, unbelievable, honestly. Overcome with grief and pain. Darrell's future was put on hold. My biggest supporter wasn't here no more, kind of took a turn downhill. Unfortunately, a common hardship, gun violence plaguing Louisville, especially over the last week. More than two dozen people shot, some victims only 14 years old. You're never going to stop all the crime. You're never going to stop all the killing. But one way to attack that is to show them that you care. Chris Forehand is a youth coach and the man behind We All Can Folk, a nonprofit that mentors young lives, including Darrell. We as a community cannot give up on any kid, and we definitely can't get a, give up on kids of this magnitude. He's worked with Darrell in the years since his father's death, encouraging the decision to chase his dream once more. Darrell was accepted to Hawking College in Ohio to play football and starts in two weeks. His message for other Louisville teens that might be struggling is simple. Don't give up on yourself. Heather Fountaine, WHAS 11 News.